I don't think it <laughs> I feel like my hair doesn't match my shirt. Today, I not only feel 90s, I feel 90s grunge. Oh. Hey guys, how's it going? Did I shave my armpits? I don't remember. <laughs> it's a question we ask ourselves. So today we're sharing our favorite beauty favorites and non-beauty favorites and all favorite -y things. So if you enjoy knowing other people's favorites, I love watching favorites, give it a thumbs up and we'll keep doing them. Yes, and if you're not subscribed, you should be subscribed because we have a fun giveaway where you could be entered to win a MacBook Air if you are subscribed. That's all you have to do. I'm doing a finger dance. Or if you want an iPad, then you can go to Instagram and follow us there, like and comment on our photos and you will be entered to get an iPad and that is 11th Gorgeous. Yes, so speaking of really fun contests, before we jump into our favorites, we wanted to remind you guys about the e.l.f. contest that we are a part of and we are so excited about. It is the e.l.f. Cosmetics Beauty Skate Ultimate Beauty Weekend. Oh my gosh, it means it's going to be the ultimate beauty weekend where it's like 50 of you guys get to win a trip to San Francisco. Yes, we are getting to the end of the lips portion of the contest, so we wanted to remind you guys to enter on Instagram using our prompt that we told you about in our official announcement video. So you have until June 4th to enter the lips portion. There will be a face portion after that, so don't despair. There are more chances to win. We're going to be there. As well as two other people. Yes, two other channels, and we're going to be talking about beauty and elf cosmetics and awesomeness things. and so we really want to hang out with you guys so definitely make sure you check out the official rules and get entered so that we can all hang out and you're going to want to use two hashtags elf contest and placation yay okay so go get entered and now we're going to tell you all about our favorites so who wants to kick off the favorite tracy does I will let you guys remember, go ahead, remember, when we did our Products Not Worth the Hype video. And I talked about this guy. And it's the L'Oreal Infallible Pro Matte Dim Matte Finish in, I actually got a different color. Cause you guys were like, try a different color. I think you'll like it. And so I got 102 Shell Beige and I like it. But do you love it? So I love my CoverGirl Ready Set Gorgeous, which is what I've been using pretty much nonstop. But I think in the summertime, my skin is a midge too oily and I start getting like the breakthrough oiliness. So I think this is helping because it's a demi mat. I mean, so far I kind of want it. I'm not mad at it. All right, drugstore products. I have revisited this mascara again. I bounce back and forth, but I got the CoverGirl Lash Blast Fusion because the orange one was out. And oh. so it like forced me to go back to it and try it. And I love it, but I love all the CoverGirl like Lash Blast, Lash Blast lines because they just, they let me layer. They, they don't stay wet for too long. Like after a couple of days of using it, it's already at a perfect consistency and that's key with mascara. So I've been loving it and Flash Blast mascara. It will forever be my favorite. Well, Flash Blast. Another super stinking affordable product is the Essence Make Me Brow. And Make me brow. I don't have it on today. I actually have a different eyebrow thing going on, which we'll link that. In. We'll link that you video. It was, a, it was a good one. But I have been loving this Essence Make Me Brow. We told you guys about it in something. But this is like, looks like it's Benefit Gimme Brow, the old packaging, because they have new packaging now. Ooh. This is in the color Blondie Brows. If you're looking for an affordable option, check out Ulta. That's where we found it. And it's $2.99. What? Okay. Still affordable products, products. Hmm. All right, this is the NYX lingerie lipstick, and I think I've mentioned this. It was our Ulta haul. Yeah, because you just had already worn it a little bit and yes, you really liked it. Yes, I still love it. I'm really loving my liquid lipsticks. That's where I talked but, about my Gimme Brow was in the Ulta haul. Yeah, 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 but this one just is really, I really like the tone of it, and it's not as drying. The color of this one just stands out. It's a nice mauve color, and every time I wear it, everyone's like, your lips match your hair. So anytime you've like pretty much seen me wear a lip that matches my hair, it's this one. <laughs> Spell up. Speaking of lips, this is a new one for me. This is the Beautifully Bare Satin Lipstick from e.l.f. Cosmetics. And I was wearing this in a video and tons of you guys were asking me what it was. And it's in the color Touch of Blush. Mm -hmm. And it's just a really pretty, looks very similar to what I have on today. But as a Slightly little bit warmer. more satiny finish. So there we go. I really like it and you guys did too. Oh, also we've got like a fun little lip kit on Elf's website right now yeah. with some of our favorite picks and we'll link down below. Yes, and something else even more exciting coming. So yeah. stay tuned. Stay tuned. And, uh, but you guys know we love our lippies. So. Speaking of how much we love our lippies, I thought I'd talk about another one. I don't know if I've talked about this one before. Yes, I do. I talked about it in the Ulta haul. <laughs> and it's the Buxom Full On Lipstick. It's like a matte kind of plumpy lipstick. And this one's in the color Dolly, and I'm wearing it right now. And 
it's like the perfect amount of color to where it still really looks natural I yeah. feel like like a my lips but better kind of color mm -hmm. I love it and even though it's matte it doesn't like make your lips look dry and gross because my yeah. lips are actually really dry right now and I don't think they look that bad no. I'm obsessed with it it's my I like favorite. it too I really like it too Tracy I have to, wants get, it. I have to go get me some yeah it's really yeah. pretty and because it's so skinny it's easy to draw on and I don't need lip liner okay so uh, speaking of nothing to segue into this <laughs> Speaking of not shaking my armpit. There you go, there you go. I actually went to the dentist yesterday and I told Stephanie, I was like, I gotta get my deodorant game on because the stress sweat is real. And we actually learned about stress sweat and it's like some of the worst kind of sweat or whatever. The stinkiest sweat. The stinkiest sweat is the stress sweat. So this is a new scent and I've been loving it from Secret. It's Capri and it says Capri Islander Treat. And I would sniff it, but it's been under your arm. It's okay. No, it doesn't smell like armpit. So still love in the Paris Rose, but this That's is, what's on my counter. I yeah. always curse rose it. This is a new love for me. This is something I've been using probably for the past, I'm gonna say two months. Mm, just a good mathematical estimate. And that is the Stila Eyes Are the Window Shadow Palette. It's the soul, the yeah. actual version, yeah. because I think there's multiple colors. This is some of my favorite like colors for this time of the year, very purpley, mauve colors. I don't know why, but I was wearing some of these colors in a different palette in Vegas last year, and it kind of made me want to wear those colors again because I really enjoyed Vegas. I wanna go back to Vegas! It's so fun, but I really love this sparkly color. It's a good inner corner, and this is gorgeous in the crease. It's so pretty. They have names. Kitten and Affection. Kitten is like a they're they're Mm -hmm. No wonder I love it so much. It's a good one. People love it. I wasn't it. even looking at the colors, but it's Kitten and Affection. There's just really good colors. There's lots of good transition shades. I just feel like I can get so much out of this palette. Okay, I know everyone is on that like color corrector train, but for me, it just doesn't get better than putting like an apricot -y, peachy tone under here before I put my foundation on. That I cannot. Technically that is color correcting though. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, I'm saying that's the only one for that me like. yeah. that I really can get on the train of and so I got this from influencer a little while ago and I stinking love it it's the YSL to she clat good luck saying that one yeah and it's the color corrector version and I think it's Apricot Bisque is what it's called. We told you guys about an influencer. It's really cool. You get free awesome makeup and- You just got something yesterday, like a, like I, a survey. I got a campaign. Yeah, I got invited to be in a campaign and I don't know. One thing it talked about was like highlighting and stuff. Yeah. And then the other thing it was talking about was Concealer. concealers and stuff. Don't know what it's gonna no. be. I'm excited to find out. But we'll have a link down below where you can sign up because I just, I think everyone should sign up. My next favorite are four boobies, but I have been really loving the Victoria's Secret bralettes that come up to here. So when I went to Victoria's Secret to get another color of that, I saw this bralette. And I'm all about bralettes with cups in them. And these and the ones that come to your neck have cups like in them. Like normal bras. Yeah, like normal bras, but like decorative when you're wearing it because I don't have a ton of boobs. Support. Support's always good. Support is good for everyone and yeah. bralettes are not forgiving sometimes. These are forgiving and flattering. so many flattering. So many pretty colors. So I love this one and I've been wearing the stink out of it. Like literally Ew, I might need to wash no. it. Wait, okay, on to the like not fashion and beauty stuff. Because you guys know we always like to sprinkle those in. <laughs> this month we decided. <laughs> sprinkle, sprinkle, sprinkle of sprinkling. This month we decided to include a food favorite because we visited our sister this month, so we've been eating oh, a lot. Oh, we've been eating, and we've been eating out. Which is delicious, but not always the best for it's you. It's delicious, but not always nutritious. There you go. So if you guys remember, we talked in a video, maybe a couple months ago about HelloFresh because it is a subscription service meal plan that is so convenient. So convenient. And so delicious. Yes. It also, I think is really cool because it lets you shake things up. I know I get in the rut of like a few meals that I just go to because they're easy. Are you kidding me? Tacos and stroganoff all the time. <laughs> what is that? Yeah. So HelloFresh is really cool because they they can kind of come together with these really awesome different recipes that are done with dietitians. So they're nutritionally balanced. Fresh produce and, and fresh just ingredients. Yeah, you don't have to go to the grocery store. It comes to you in like a cooled box 
and you just come home and you're like, oh my God, I have meals for the next I'm like, gonna play chef and I'm gonna make these awesome meals and I don't even have to think about what I'm cooking for the next like week. The other thing that's been difficult for me is that when you're cooking for two people and you go to the grocery store and get the ingredients to make some of the meals, I have so much leftover stuff because I only do a recipe that calls for, you know, that one crazy spice one time. Yeah. And not the spices go bad that often, but you know what I'm saying? Like I, I have so many things where it's like, I don't end up using it and it goes bad. Yeah, and these come super pre-portioned with like all of your spices. Like if you're gonna use mustard in this thing, it's gonna come with a little jar of mustard. Like those cute it. little teeny like, you know, like I'm a giant. Yeah. So on top of all the convenient aspects of it, it, they don't even take that long to prepare. Like yeah. 30 minutes and you're eating. I know that after I get done working all day, I don't want to go home and cook for like two hours. I don't wanna go, go to the grocery store and get all the ingredients. I don't wanna go home and cook forever. So I just love how easy and fast it is. And I'm getting good food. You can't beat it. We'll have the link down below if you want to try it and the promo code EG05 where you can save $35 off of your first week delivery. That's awesome. I know, I know. I know I love to try before I commit. So it's a really awesome way to check it out and see if it's something that you like. I think both of our favorite TV show of the month was Dancing with the Stars. It, it was, was so, so good. Like this was the best season it's had in a while. I might have cried a few times. Oh my God, it was so good. And I'm so happy that Niall won. Really mad that the family got canceled. Really mad. And so, Nashville. That too, go tweet. There's like a bring back Nashville and bring the family back. Yeah, so go check out Twitter. If you loved those shows, go put it out there because they need to come back. You know, with all the painting we've been doing, I really didn't have that much time to read this month. <laughs> we've so. been painting like our entire upstairs for houses. And we've been rocking out to 90s on Spotify. Yeah. Well. So favorite music of the month would be 90s alternative. Yeah. Which is probably why I've been dressing so 90s. Probably. I'm like feeling 90s. Probably. So tell us down below what your favorite things of the month are. Yeah, we would love to know because we always like to check out the things that you guys are loving too. Fun fact, someone said that they loved Infusium 23 to save their hair color, so I bought Infusium 23. Oh my 23. god, our hair color was our favorite of the month. It Forgot was. about that, it's a little gone now, but pictures on Instagram, follow us there. Tell us if we should do it again and what color we should do next. And if there are any products that are good, like the Girl Told Me Infusium 23, are there hair colors that are like good products to use? Yeah. So. Give this video a thumbs up, don't forget to subscribe, and we're gonna talk to you guys in another video very soon. We sure will. Bye.